Oh, g'day, I'm Darren. I'm the farm manager here at Bangadang Farm. And hi, I'm Tom and I work on the Marin project here at Bangadang. And we're down here at 3B today. 3B is the, actually the oldest dam on our farm. It covers approximately six acres and it was originally built probably 20 years ago now, but it was built as a stock dam back in the day, just purely for water for stock and uh, his cattle that he was running here. And what a beautiful dam it is with wildlife on top and wildlife below, but how different it was six months ago. Being the oldest stock dam, it had accumulated a lot of carbon and natural organic waste that uh, due to not having masses of aeration throughout the dam, had slowly built up and over time causing an anaerobic environment. So essentially the dam was eating itself and that causes what they colloquially call sludge on the bottom of the dam. So this was confirmed by looking at the phytoplankton and the zooplankton within the dam, which was largely non-existent and a very low level of dissolved oxygen within the water. And some samples led us to believe that there was a buildup of sludge in certain areas across the dam. In a gully dam environment, we believe this was the perfect opportunity to develop a dam of the future that is better suited to Marin. So step one was to empty the dam. And then uh, step two, we moved in and we removed all the logs out of the bottom of the dam. And step three, we brought in a couple of excavators and a bulldozer to help shake the bottom of the pond. Those initial stages provided a brilliant platform to maximise the dam into a marron pond and also an irrigation dam. So stages four continued with the shaping of the pond to provide a gradient for the marron to live in. Stage five was to include scour pipes to remove the waste if it built up in the future. Stage six was providing habitat for the marron. Stage seven, providing aeration, silt curtains, and opening up the dam via pontoons. Here we are six months later with a completely refurbished dam. We've just added 50,000 juveniles and we look forward to seeing how they progress over the next 18 months.